and welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Marina from Mondays with Marina. I've cleaned the cupboard and I found all these little stuffies that I want to throw away. And um, I decided today that maybe I must make something with it. As you can see, it's random stuff. It's chipboard and it's flowers and it's everything. So I grabbed a piece of chipboard and I'm going to cover this with gesso first because we will use some wet mediums on all that to create with that so let's start with some white gesso Okay, so everything is covered now and now it has to dry before you can carry on. Okay, so that's dry now. Now I'm going to choose something. I just want to use a stencil and this is the way I store my stencil. I've got one of these big rings and I've got all my stencils. Well, I've got the big ones together and then I've got all the celebrate ones together and there's a primo one or two in there but everything is together and then i just hang it that's the way i store my stencils okay let's see we can choose just about anything okay i decided on the Fleur de Lis one and I'm going to use my mixed media paste again and I'm just going to apply here and there Okay, it's dry and now we can start with the layout. Let's see what we've got. I've got a frame and then I've got some, I've got a friend and we always joke about these paint brushes because we never cleaned it immediately. It ends up on an off the page thing. So this is where this is going to end up. Uh, let's see. Okay. That's going to be there. I think. Let's see what I've got. I've got old flowers and I've got 
just about everything. Ooh, left over stuff from projects that I've done, pages that I've done. Um, let's see, okay. I think I'm going to put this here, like that. Okay, I suggest you take a photo of what you have here. Okay, and that's what I've, I'm left with. I suggest you take a photo of the basic layout so that you don't forget because we need to stick everything now. <clears throat> I'm going to use heavy gel medium and you will use quite a lot on a layout like this use another paintbrush
to end off with some mixed media stones. Um, I just want to place some stones. I just mix it with heavy gel medium you can do this on a scrapbook page as well and then just This looks stunning on a, um, a sea page. If you've done a, a holiday page, you can use the stones on there as well. I can't put this in there now. Okay, I think I've done. I'm done playing. This has got to dry now before we carry on again. And a gel medium does take a while to dry, especially in the winter when it's cold. So go do something else while this dries. Well, everything is dry now. Um, if you've got black gesso then you use black gesso if you haven't got black gesso you use white gesso and black acrylic paint i have black gesso and i'm just going to cover everything with black gesso now
Well, I think I've covered everything. I hope I've covered everything. I don't see any white spots anymore. Um, now it's got to dry again. Okay, well, everything is dry and I can see all the white spots, but I don't care about the white spots anymore. It's all over. Um, I'm going to use the metallic waxes to finish off this, um, this piece. And I've decided on these four colors. So let's go. I've got the rich gold. And I've got the emerald moss. The copper blaze. And the antique gold. So just watch me playing.
okay i think i'm done if you want to change anything change it thank you for watching and enjoy the rest of the day remember to like and subscribe please and then have a nice day thank you